there is a positive and there is a negative to that. Well, he never said it's going to be AI. He never said that, okay? The show was great. Love the show. It was amazing. And it was kind of cool to see what the future is like. Of course, I don't like the lying part. You know, it was shady. Anthony says, did you talk about Elon fake the optimus talking with humans behind the curtains? Anyone else would get laughed at, but the media kind of overlooked it so weird. Well, this is exactly why I didn't want to do this and talk about it the next day. Because like same day, next day, you know, people didn't know that. It, it wasn't until like all these videos from Tesla fanboys and girls who were at the event, um, uh, you know, posted them. And the experts were like, gee, we call bullshit, right? It usually takes two or three days at least after these events for us to really know what happened. So now that we do, yes. So here's the thing. There is a positive and there is a negative to that. Uh, negative, obviously, is that, well, and I know and I know Tesla fanboys, they go like, well, he never said it's going to be AI. He never said that, okay? Okay, but... When you've been, you know, this is an AI event, right? This is where you're showcasing AI, robo taxis, robo vans. You decided to bring robots in there, right? Um, we kind of expect you to showcase the AI, which he didn't. But uh, it would be nice if he would just mention that. Saying, you know, uh, and this is the positive, right? Essentially what they showed us, and by the way, the show was great. Love the show. It was amazing. Great location, great everything, great. I mean, I, I love watching the event. But, and, and the videos that came from the event, which in many cases were even better than, than the live stream. Um, what, what they did, they showcased us what the future would be like right? What would it be like when cars will be driving us and robots would be serving us dream, uh, drinks, right? Nobody has ever done that. And it was kind of cool to see what the future is like. And, you know, I'm almost 50 years old. There's a possibility and very good possibility, unless like, you know, I, I die sooner rather than later. You know, if I live even an average lifespan of a time man, um, I will probably be just like all of you in that situation where I would arrive at the event in a self-driving pod and there will be robots serving drinks and talking and all that stuff. So I thought it was really cool. Right? Nobody has ever done that. So that was great. Of course, I don't like the lying part. You know, it was shady what they did with that. Um, so I feel like there was positive. I think there was negative. Um, and of course, like, you know, I was talking to I don't want to disclose. Okay, I'll disclose the conversation. I won't disclose who it was with. But it was one of Tesla fanboys you're probably familiar with. You know, I asked that person. I said, you know, what did you think of that? He's like, oh, well, the um, the robots were really incredible. I was like, what, what was the incredible part of it? So you, the way they move. Look at the way they move. I was like, you know, this is how I have it. Like, it's amazing that, that Tesla fans just – not aware of anything that's going on outside of Tesla world, right? Um, if you research the Tesla, uh, the, the, the ro robotics and spe specifically humanoids, what Tesla robots did at that event is something that's been accomplished five, six, seven years ago by many other companies. Um, so I was like, well, have you seen other robots, what they can do? Like, oh, you. so how can you be amazed? by something that you didn't really know even existed and others have done much better. So it, another positive, I'll, I'll give you another positive is, you know, there is a good reason why those robots, nobody ever heard of them. I bet if you're watching me, you probably have not seen other robots, humanoid ro robots do much, you know? And, the re and, and whenever Elon Musk does something and Tesla does something, right? That puts it on the map as a thing. And I think that now that robots, humanoid robots, is a thing, and Elon made it a thing, the other companies that are much better than Tesla, one will feel like, hey, competition from Tesla is coming, so we better, like, chop, chop. Secondly, more money from investors will probably be coming in because, you know, Elon's giving this Free promotion, right? Elon just promoted every single company that's going to be and is making robots right now. So there will be more investment. 
this will probably move forward faster. Does every idea coming out of Elon's mouth becomes a thing? No, but a lot of them do. So I thought it was actually a cool preview and it's great to put it on the map. I hated the way he did it, but I'm glad he did. Does that make sense?